Hello, Recon87, and welcome back to Strategic Command World War I uh, with the Empire's Internal DLC, where we've been checking out the Russian Civil War scenario, playing as the White Russians. And things are going pretty well, to be honest. We've uh, kind of really stabilised our front. We've pushed uh, fairly aggressively in the south, capturing the key city of Tsaritsyn, which is obviously Stalingrad or Volgograd, depending on which name you want to go by as well. Um, and we have kind of crushed the initial... Ukrainian resistance and then using the Polish army to help stabilize the front in eastern Ukraine and we have started to kill a lot of Bolsheviks uh, Not making huge forward progress, but we are inflicting a lot of pain upon them elsewhere uh, But things are steady. Uh, we we're starting to kind of ease in towards Petrograd, uh, although the, the Baltics are still a li little ropey However, at the tail end of the last turn, or the last episode, we lost the British and the American. They had enough of this intervention malarkey and have pulled out. So as we rejoin this one, we're having to see what life is like as we start to stand on our own two feet. This, was, of course, was taken from a Twitch stream, so without any further ado, I'll hand you over to the live Twitch audio. Okay. Things we need to do. Well, for a start... Oh, there's no even there. Okay, you can hopefully clear that next turn. Wish you would clear this little spot. Like so. Beautiful. You, I'd like to go r r racing off somewhere else, actually. Can you operate? No, you can't. Let's get you over here. You guys can head north, and you also need to start heading north. Actually, I'll move you onto that tile next turn. Uh, I may need to leave a couple of you behind to deal with that and whatever happens over in Baku. So, yeah. Up to you three will keep hold of a ball. The uh, Where are you? This area. Caucasus. I what it's called there. Uh, good, right, next up. Now we're probably not in position to take this town this turn. Hopefully we're in a good place for next turn. How's supply? Is okay actually. Oh no, there doesn't exist and there doesn't exist. Oh, it's this turn. Next turn. Yeah, they're okay. They're not ideal, but they are okay. His supply is also terrible. He is now cut off. This should be good. Uh, you guys are slow. Actually, you can come down this way now. Connect up the roads and be in supply. Yeah, that's just three, but it's something. You can head back here. Okay, you're still blocking force. You're a blocking force. You have now turned up over here. We're going to start to push back in this direction. Uh, I don't want to attack this turn. We've just moved in. I want also to throw in some entrenchments just to cause them a few problems. I'd also like to spend some money on you. And sure, I'll do it on you. I should have moved you out of town first. But... Say la vie. Uh, you guys are fine where you are, so chill. Poland here, we're just going to crush some buckets. Oh, I thought he would get a kill there. He did not. Hm. Uh, I suppose you can do it. Really? Okay. Got him in the end. It's annoying because actually you need to uh, have a rest, but something, something, no rest for the wicked. And what I would like actually is to get these little garrison units uh, around the road to Kiev and have a HQ signal with Kiev. Okay, let's see if we can smash you. Excellenty. Which is a good place for supply. Yeah, excellent. I'll send you my little, my little kind of can we sneak around the side forces. 
Uh, obviously, it's limit as far as we can go, but that's not a bad limit. Okay, here. Zero, zero is not ideal. That works better than planned. You can get a zero one. Let's do it. Anyone else go over here? You can. Didn't get it. Now, what's happened to my beautiful, beautiful supply? It's less beautiful. Right, I think we're going to head in this way, and we're probably going to have to make a play on this place first, because supply is better because of uh, Kalnus. All those ships have disappeared. Let's get you boosted. Actually, pull you back for just now, and we'll send you there. Okay, we've got a little bit of an army. Yeah, this is this is terrible. So let's pull back so we don't want to engage. We'll have a blocking force and we'll probably have to spend send a couple of people just marching to recapture all this stuff. Will we get our supply next time? We'll okay. So we'll be okay for supply, but some tidy up is required. And honestly, you are not gonna do much. Um on your own, so I'll send you down as well. We'll have a bit more of a fighting force. Okay, uh, ah, yeah, you... Now, apparently it's all going to go in our favour. Yeah, you see, it just didn't... Oh, that did. Come on. That was pretty big. That was pretty big. These guys are all going to be fine. Bit of iron arm will push on. That was awesome. Yeah, that's not really... That's not doing much. Have we done this one? No. Just maneuvered this turn. You need to change your entrenchments. Okie dokie. Oh, you gave me your tank. Oh. Oh, I need to get you in the action. Sweet. I thought it was a British unit, but that's uh, Southern Whites. Nice. Okay, we now even have enough, because you're maxed on research, to buy a unit. Imagine that for the Southern Whites here. Uh, and to be honest, I think I just need some more. Oh, actually, guns would be really useful. Okay, I need some guns. Purchase me one artillery piece, please. Thank you very much. Uh, Poland has a little bit of points. Yes, we did lose the British ones. That's fine. Presumably I still get their minus. Do I still get the support, actually? Do you show me? Uh, no. Where's my financial report? I might have to wait until the... Um, Start next turn to see if I'm still getting financial support from them. One would hope so. Oh, it feels like a long way to Moscow. But I definitely feel like we've we we are on the offensive now. And the Adtrakan's gonna fall. We've closed up this pocket nicely, and then we're pushing into Kharkov. And then the kind of this access to Moscow. Our problem is our Poles will take Warsaw and then stop. Here's a bit of a mess. Finland would be nice to get involved because then we could tidy up all this stuff. 
and help our northern push. Right, I'm just going to keep the poles 54 points in the pocket for just now, I think. Uh, we did, yeah, because those points haven't gone anywhere, so that's absolutely fine. Oh, we're down to 20. Oh, did we have quite a lot in, in America and the US? We did. All right. I'm willing to put another 50 in there. 25% chance per turn. That seems reasonable. It's advanced time. Really? It's because of the shenanigans. Okay, they'll be fine for next turn, though. The advances of the white forces on Petrograd damages Bolshevik fighting spirit. Oh, brilliant. Finland have moved 9% closer. Hey, and we got some logistics. Badly needed. Yeah, that's not ideal. Nor was that. Nor was that. Stop it. That was okay. That was also okay. Oh, I need to reinforce that unit. And sort of entrenchments out, but... Generally, this fight's going okay. This one, not so much. Uh, the Donetsk mine has been disrupted. And you... Oh, ooh, okay. Oh, you did damage me. God. <laughs> right, let's get you out of town before we do anything else with you. Okie dokie. Let's start. Well, we don't have any caucuses to tidy up. Well, we've got one. Um. Yeah, well, let's move you guys home, I think. Start pushing north. Uh, let's see. One to one, one to zero, one to two to one's the best we've got. Actually, gonna start with this one to one, which did not go well. Two to one went as expected. I'm not convinced we've got the strength here to take it. Yeah, not with rolls like that. Oh, nice. It definitely went in our favour. That's not really good enough. I think I'm going to pull you out the way. We might be able to get them next turn. I also think if I move the HQ into this tile, oh, because you're not at seven, you're only at down at two. Ah, it's because our supplies are being knackered because the damage the cities are damaged, which uh, is fair. See, so yeah, it's down at a one, which we recover over time. Grr. Could throw you into the mix as well. There's no immediate threat here. Let's do that. It's a it's a bold move, Con. Okay. Here we should have some um uh, success. Okay, good. I'm even going to advance with this core. Let's advance with this HQ. Yeah, let's put a little bit of pressure on here. You can spend a turn recuperating. I'm okay with that. French being French. Ah, tanks on the way. Good job, little guard unit. Uh, 
sure, just fire you along here. You really, I really stopped pushing you forward quite so aggressively. So these guys can go all the way to this border. Yeah, Ukraine, 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 Bolsheviks, yeah. Which I think they probably end up, probably end up doing, clear out this area and then just fortunately chill. Oh, you guys can't move around? You can, you can't move in, that's a really weird movement pattern there. Okay, this guy is completely cut off. I should be fine with an HQ here. It is. All right, next turn we'll put some pressure on Minsk. Hmm. You're being weird. Yeah, I need to move on to the south side of the city. Fives are okay though. Four is not great. So, okay, I might have forgotten to move you next, last turn. Oh no, I put you back by accident. You come out of there. Okay, and you got up to 10. That's really useful. That's going to help immensely. Up here, you stay where you are. You guys are going to head down this way. Um... Honestly, I think I might have to pull back and just let this guard unit die. Well, at least give yourself some entrenchment. In fact, can I, I can maybe heal you up? At one point, that was not worth it. Right. And who's supply looking? Not uh, okay. Improves next turn. This is good. Then we'll try and go against Umutmansk. I think. Groovy sauce. Right. Is there anything I can do with? Okay, I can still spend on. Um. Estonian and Latvian stuff, which is useful. What about France? Greek things, okay. France is gonna run away soon. So why don't I just do this? Get you in the war. Uh, purchases, I don't really have the money for it. Research, did I cap you out? Got 50 spare, ah, oh, which I can throw into here. Oh, yeah, because we've got logistics. Actually, that works out perfectly. And then I'll keep your 70 points for something else. All right, again, I feel like we are making reasonable progress. This is a little bit more dodgy now. We lost an HQ support. Up here is fine. This feels good. This feels grindy, but hey ho. I think this one, this feel, this feels inevitable. So, go watch their fighting spirit. It's a bit low. Okay, good. They left. Thank you. Ah, sweet. More armies. Oh, and artillery. Hungarian Super Republic was down. It didn't say, but numbers looked okay, but maybe I'm not getting the, same, the financial support I, I once was getting. Hello. They could have taken Saritsyn with that horse unit. Why are you doing so badly? I don't like that. Okay, they angrily lashed out my little unit there. Ditto up here. But if they're attacking, they're not reinforcing, and this should be fine for us. Indeed it is.
Oké. Okay. Uh, so first off, is taking this little place, which we do actually with relative ease. Now, can you get there? No. It's also severely damaged. It's going to take a bit of time to recoup. Let's put you back defending there. And let's go see if we can't punish these Soviet horsey boys. And they may well be able to escape, but... Uh, it's a reasonable pressure nonetheless. Now, next turn, how are we looking for supply? Still terrible. Uh, it will take maybe a, one or two turns for this to recover from the fighting, and then it should be okay. Oh yeah, you can come up here as well. Again, it's going to take a little bit of time to recover, but even then things are starting to filter forward a little bit more. I was going to say, well, my destroyer bridge left. I forgot about that. Okay, and then, yeah, let's just throw some entrenchments up. Just in cases. I think we'll maybe go and try and grab this town, actually, because that'll help us on this road north as well. Okay, then we'll swing east to this... Uh, fairly su successful little push over here. Oh, starting to get a little bit harder. Uh, well, let's bring you... Can I give you a full... I can't, right, let's get you up to full strength. I never check for, like, upgrades and stuff. Nobody looks like they can upgrade. French can, but... That ain't much use to us. Hmm, okay, not quite as good numbers. Yeah, really not quite as good numbers, actually. Okay, tell you what, let's just... Spend a turn letting the boys recover. A bit better positions, and then we'll try and maybe push forward. They've got a bit of, um... Defences, which probably is helping their cause. Ooh, you have artillery. I would very much like. Smash that in the face. Oh, I should have known that was going in badly. What was up in Kiev? You head up the road. You need to head up the road as well. I think you guys are going to end up kind of just being a little bit of uh, barrier units around Kiev. Don't know what I'm going to do with you, but you'll head over this way. Okay. And get you up to full strength, which I think makes a lot of sense. France is about to go bye bye, but that's not really a problem. Yeah, we don't. I don't understand why you can't even step there. Go on the railway line now. First roll fails. Oh, but a two to one, though. Another one. Okay, that's good. It will be uh, interesting to see how much they recover. That's still a three. It don't stand there. But these are now seven, seven, six. So that's the three we really want to. Uh... Yeah, 
control for the push in. Right. Meanwhile, you, I think, are well placed to head south. Clear Riga. Oh, I don't want my guns going towards Petrograd. Hmm. Any chance? Nah, not quite. Worth it, though. Right, well, you guys keep chilling out there. Uh, here. to pull back, let, jump on the next road and then push down. It's a really slow grindy process, unfortunately. I don't want to go for it. Yeah, one-to-one's okay. Didn't get the shatter. <laughs> Say, Levy. that instead. Okay, and oddly enough, oh, well, you've attacked. You actually want to entrench behind you, but this seems to be going okay. Yeah. This Bolshevik scum won't know what hit him. Oh, uh, you can't advance. Points and prizes. The UK can't do anything with theirs because they're out. France doesn't have enough. You do have enough for a unit, I believe. We bought artillery. It was 300. We could buy more. More artillery is always good. But I probably would like another core as well. Just on this southern front. Because especially once the Polish army reach the limit of what they can do. Cool. I think that's all. Another turn done. Heading into late mid August. And there goes France. Standing alone now. And logistics, nice. Ooh. Hello, new troops. And you won't run far. Oh, 11 to an experienced unit. And this way is a little open there, France has left. Yeah, you look, I think you're not. Uh, uh, noises. I think the supply there is not good. But I think with Poland we can deal with this somebody pocket here. Yeah, people are concerned. But honestly, it's fine. You guys have got this. First Silesian uprising with Germans and Poles clash in Silesia. Okay, I mean, who is my... Especially my northern whites are the worst at 56. Southern whites are still 77. Bolsheviks are 81. So it gives you kind of an idea of where things play. Right, so... Let's start pushing you fine gentlemen down the road. Uh, actually, you can come all the way down the road. So next turn we'll have 765, so yeah, 433. This should be... He says, hopefully, acceptable. 543, 543. I mean, 3s and 4s are not great. But that should also start improving as well. Uh, up here, you guys can get the kill. Congratulations. In town. Uh, and you guys can come get some supply from that town. And then, uh, yeah. Well, 
Saratov's got people in it, but still, it's something. Uh, do I need you down support? I don't. I think I've got plenty of troops here, so let's head you in this direction and start doing some more scouting and marauding. Okay, there are some big attacks over here. You look vulnerable. Nice. Let's bring in this unit. Oh, come on, boys. Well, that's uncomfortable. Um, I kind of want to switch down and finish it off, but four, four free attack on four and an eleven strength unit is uh, is just too much to pass up. Smash in the face. That uh, wasn't free, but okay. I badly need some more troops over here, which we are going to get, because we're going to free up a bunch pretty quickly. In fact, let's free you up now. And of course we have the poles. Oh, didn't mean to do that, but okay, apparently we're in this position now. Which direction do I want to push? I think I think I do want to push over here. Not so worry about Connell Top itself. Try and kind of squish them in the Somni direction. And then go up towards Common Top. So if we can get you just essentially to sit there and hold the line, I would be eternally grateful. Now eventually I'm gonna pull the Ukraine guy out here and swing over here so they're all kind of Together. Okay, that pleases me. Minsk did not reinforce. Good night, Minsk. Hmm. Cool. Uh, so I'll leave someone in Minsk to defend them, and everyone else is just going to push down because, well, they can't actually. Baltic states, Ukraine, or the Bereznia River. So yeah, we need to. We can't. I mean, is Gommel okay? It feels like probably not. You gotta draw the border somewhere. Okay. Hey, look. See when you actually are in supply, your attacks work. And just like that, that took way longer than it should have done. Okay, cool. Uh, I think I'm going to send you over this way. Okay, nice. Start putting pressure on Riga. I need someone to take that tile so I can bombard you with a train. Uh, so, yeah, if you fall there, here, yeah, do you know what? Just pull back. They can. Oh, I thought that was a town for some reason. I no wonder you're having such a bad time of it. You go take this and that. Uh, your supply is still god awful, so just hang out where you are. Should probably leave someone there to defend that town, shouldn't I? So a couple of fives and some threes is about all the fighting place we've got. We might just have to brute force it with these guys. Hopefully we'll have the strength because we're professional soldiers and they are not. But no, we shall see. Honestly, you should come back and help 
clear Samara, so these guys can deal with Saratov if we want to deal with Saratov. And then we're back down to the beginning again. Uh, I think things are going relatively well. Research. Poland, how you doing? You can research lots of stuff. Uh, do you know what? I, should, I, I slightly regret that, because I'm not sure it's as big a deal. Because I think you're actually going to be out of the fight quite soon. So I'm going to keep, as I was going to say, I'm going to keep you doing diplomacy. Let's push up to 20% turn. They're almost there. Uh, da -da -da. So who got logistics? You guys did. I have another logistics. No. Three, I'll get you all with level 3 at some point. You might have enough for a unit as well. can't remember how much they were. Two, two, five. Nice. What I've not been doing, which I do a lot of time, is the production of industrial technology, which gives you more money and then makes things cheaper, but I'm not sure, given the length of it, it's that useful in this scenario. Uh, sure. More units. Push on Moscow. If we can quickly check... Which one is it? Info? Victory conditions. Okay, white minor machine. Moscow or Petrograd, we're not putting here. Turinson, yes. Minsk, yes. Kiev, yes. Arkhangelsk, don't know. Ekaterinburg, don't know. Rostov, Warsaw, Tallinn. Warsaw, Tallinn. Warsaw, yes. Tallinn, yes. Where's Ekaterinburg? Arkhangelsk is up here. Do we hold already? Yeah, okay, fine. And then there's just... That one. Okay. So we've got so we've got everything for a minor victory. Um if we take Moscow or Petrograd, we get a major victory. And then we take them both, we get the decisive victory. Or we smash the things better. We're not that close to that. I don't know how many turns into it we are actually. Although given the, the uh Oh yeah, we went to 1922, so I feel like we've still got a fair way to go. Uh, please don't do that. Yeah, definitely can't move in. That's fine. Oh, hello. Get across the river. You just hit them. They're... What? How did you get hurt by horses? Nonsense. Um, cool. And that's where we're going to bring this episode to a close. And that is also, in fact, where we ended that stream as well. So I'm, I'm really pleased with the direction the game uh, is going, or was going, I suppose, a historic event now. I think the next key object for us is really going to be to annihilate the Red Army, which has amassed itself in eastern Ukraine. Uh, and then, you know, simply walk in and take what's left. Or something like that. I guess I'll have to watch the next one to find out. So I'll see you then.